Here we have one of my favorite toy haulers that we have on the lot. It's Momentum 410th. You're in a 13.6 foot garage right now. You have the screen doors there that latch in the rear. You have rollover sofas that will give you an additional bed. Plus you have that bed on that lift system up top so you can sleep plenty here in the garage. You got speakers up here, storage, a secondary entrance directly into here. You also have a TV in here and you're also going to have a half bath. So you have an additional bathroom in here. Stepping out into your kitchen, you've got this huge fridge right here. So you're gonna have plenty of food storage, freezer down below. Four burner stove here and microwave up top. You've got your TV on that lift system. So out of the way when you're not using it, you can see you have a window right behind there. You've got some storage up top. Fireplace down below, plenty of drawer storage here. And then you've got your sink here. You're also going to have this mini hutch area right over here, as well as additional pantry space. So you've got shelf space in here and some storage up top. And then you're going to have the slide here where you have your dining section. So you've got the extended table right there. You have a couple of seating spots right here. Huge open area right here. So it's really nice and spacious. Then you've got a couple of bar stools on this side here. Making our way to your main entryway. You have this bulletin board area, place to hang your coats, dog leashes, purses, anything like that. And then you got a couple of stairs leading into your bathroom. You've got this solid grab handle right here, which is really nice because the steps are a little bit higher. Then you've got the sunken uh, shower right here. So you can step right into there. You got the bench right here. Nice upgraded shower head on this side here, place for your uh, linens and toiletries over here in this cabinet, as well this storage down below right over here. And then you've got your toilet in here and it is angled to give you a little bit of extra leg room. And then into your bedroom here, located at the front, you have a king size bed in here, plus plenty of walking room. You're going to have dresser storage here, as well as this additional dresser spot right over here that's built into that wall. TV up top, closet storage on both sides. That middle part will slide over. You can always add in a washer and dryer into here. If not, you do have adjustable shelves in here for additional storage.